Welcome to the Fox One Corp series of training videos. I'm Dave Springford. Please visit me online at www.fox1corp.com for all your glider supplies. In this video, I want to take a look at when you're flying a task, sometimes you've gone past a turn point and accidentally advanced to the next turn point too many times. So instead of now navigating to the second turn point, you're going to the third turn point and you want to be able to reset your computer, go to the previous, get back to turn point two instead of turn point three. So I want to take a look at how we can accomplish that while we're flying. So the first thing I'm going to do is we're just going to go in here and take a look at the task. We're going to edit this task and we have a 500 FAI triangle with a start on leg. We're going to start at Rockton, go south to Hagersville, west to Newbury, north up to McCullough Lake, and then back to Rockton for the finish. We can take a look at that on the map here. And we can see this is what our triangle looks like. So we're going to start right here at the red circle in Rockton, come down to Hagersville, cross to Newbury, up to McCullough, and back to the finish at Rockton. And where the plane is situated right now is we've just rounded the first turn point at Hagersville, and we're down here on the second leg headed towards Newbury. So we can see on the map we have our turn point at Hagersville here, and the gliders here. And so we can see up here on the task that we're headed to 48 Newbury. If by accident we happen to press next and we manage to get past this message, we can see that we're now headed towards McCullough Lake instead of the second turn point. And we want to be able to reset that and get back to our second turn point. And there is no previous function on these. So we need to do this by restarting. Fortunately, the computer remembers your last start time, and it also remembers when you rounded the turn point. So it's a fairly straightforward thing to change this. So we're going to go back here, and we're going to click on Restart. And it says, do we really want to restart? Yes, we do. And so now we have to click again, and we have to click Start, because we've said Restart. We haven't said Start again. So we're going to click Start, and it says Valid Start Found at 1310. That's when I actually started, so we want to say yes. So now it's navigating us towards the first turn point, Hagersville. You can see our task speed is 62 here, which takes into account the time since the turn point. If you noticed beforehand, our task speed was 91. And so all I have to do now is go to the next turn point again, and it says we got close to Hagersville. I want to say yes, and now we can see. We're back to navigating towards 48 Newbury, and our task speed is back to 91 kilometers per hour. This is particularly useful when you're flying assigned area tasks, and you think you've left the zone and you're headed towards the next one, and then you realize, ah, maybe I need to go deeper in this one. You can always go through this restart and next, next to get through all the turn points and be back to where you want. So hopefully this has shown you a new feature on your LX computer today. Please visit me online at www.fox1corp.com and subscribe to this Fox1 Corp YouTube channel.